regular polygon of six sides is formed by bending a wire of length okay so if you see uh, the magnetic field surrounding a thin straight conductor this is the formula okay so this alpha and beta are the angles subtended by this conductor on the point p okay so now let us you know solve this so we have regular polygon of six sides formed by bending wire of length four pi meters okay so therefore this basically this becomes a hexagon something like this and one side becomes 4 pi divided by 6 meters which is 2 pi by 3 meters if an electric current of 4 pi root 3 ampere so suppose you know this is the current which is flowing sorry okay now what is going to be the magnetic field at the center of the polygon okay so we have um, uh, this biot severed law which tells mu naught i dl cross r divided by 4 pi r uh, cube okay so therefore uh, we can see here that it's dl cross r so dl cross r okay in the center so dl cross r dl no, dl okay and r is this way. so dl cross r like this up so therefore the magnetic field produced here is going to be up and it's going to be like an up direction from all so therefore it's going to be additive from all the sides now let us use this formula okay so it was mu naught i by 4 pi d sin alpha plus sin beta okay so this is uh, let us say you know this is l which is already mentioned 2 by 3 pi this is l so okay now what we are doing is something like this okay so we are drawing this here so if you see this is let us say x and because it's a regular polygon of six sides hexagon so therefore this is going to be 60 degree okay so this is like 30 degree and this is 30 degree okay and this is 2 pi by 3 this total one so therefore the half part this is 2 pi by 6 meters and this is x so therefore tan 30 tan 30 degree is equal to 2 pi by 6 into 1 by x tan 30 degree is 1 by root 3 so therefore x becomes 2 pi by 6 into root 3 meters so therefore <coughs> the magnetic field is going to be mu naught by mu naught i what is i i is 4 pi root 3 ampere 4 pi root 3 mu naught i by 4 pi into d d is like this distance is t this x is going to be the d okay, as we can see here this is the d <coughs> So d is x is 2 pi into root 3 into 6 into it's sin alpha plus sin beta. So sin 30 degree is 1 by 2. So therefore 1 by 2 plus 1 by 2 and all these 6 sides are going to contribute. So therefore into 6. Okay. Now what is mu naught? Mu naught is 4 pi into 10 to the power minus 7 so 4 pi 4 pi is gone 2 pi goes like 2 here root 3 root 3 is gone and this half and half becomes 1 so 6 into 6 is 36 36 into 2 is 72 so 72 into 10 to the power minus 7 tesla so therefore the value of x becomes 72 2 